Hello guys, today I'm going to birth cousin to eat with Natalia because she recommend. Yeah, so um, I'm gonna show you guys what we're gonna eat tonight. Uh, stay tuned. Hopefully, amazing meal. Oh. Yes. Uh, Wilson. Oh. Great, we have you right over here at table 20. Sure. Uh, would you like some drink? Yes. And, uh, uh, what? Sparkling? Yeah. Yeah. Do you sparkling? Yes. So, we are here. This is my friend, Natalia. <laughs> Sup, Wilson. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. Natalia actually is professional of wine, so yeah. <laughs> if you guys want to go out with her, mm, message her later. Actually, I want to get the risotto, but I cannot eat. But I love the lobster, yeah. that's why. Yeah, it's yeah. Fun. No, I think we're good for now. Okay, thank perfect. You. Thank so, you. So, thanks. And we'll leave one and the little guy. Let me get started in a second. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hopefully, good meal. Okay, first one. Oh, good. Thank you. Surprise me, too. Nice. Let us continue with the second course, which is our Campachi crude combination of acidity and sweetness. Um, marinated and smoked soy and fermented radish juice, the same radish used with garnish, strabanera, green strawberry, and rice peas. Enjoy! Thank you! Looks nice! Yeah, the color hot. Yeah, our signature course, our unique rambola of the sea, sea urchin and three types of fish up. Reserve to look at caviar, crab roux, and the music to be filled. Do you know where uni's from? Do you know where uni's from? Japanese uni. Thank you. You know, I like the colors better on this plate. Yeah. More elegant. with Obiko and, and Yep Also I'll tell you your favorite Simon Wall <laughs> your, your favorite right? Mm -hmm. Ikura Yeah, Ikura is a When I was in Russia like my dad would often go uh, fishing to Kamchatka mm. with his friends mm -hmm. and they would bring back Fish um, in tanks mm. that was still alive. They would put it on a tank, like a giant fish on a yeah. train. We bring it back, and the fish would then live in our like the, the bathroom. Mm -hmm. Like we would put it into the bath, mm -hmm. and it would still be alive. And then we would basically kind of clean the fish, and then um, make like salmon growl like the mm. they all have like a little caviar inside them. And so I remember. Like, it sounds very fancy, but like, like all of my lunchbox was a Kura sandwich. Kura sandwich. Yeah. And that's like one thing that we had like all day. Even the black camera was so available. Mm -hmm. Russia, that it was like some. I mean, it was a. It was not like an everyday food, but it was not a big deal, if that makes sense. Like, nobody would say that. You're rich and fancy because you're eating. Yeah. Yeah, it's just like a normal thing to eat. Yeah, it was normal. It was not like um, what to do. 
the gift of the sea or fish course over all of it. Was Papalan and Sivir and Moshen have received squash, uh, sango tomatoes, and potato confit, and uh, they refill up a uh, version of the sour basil pesto. Mm. Thank you. Enjoy. Okay, our pasta for is our fortini mushroom and truffle ravioli mm -hmm. with chicken juice and lemon. And our red pepper dill with some real mushroom and young broccoli with this olive oil. And to complement it, our focaccia and our cookies. So, thank you. So, good for real, lucky. looks so nice. Yeah, it's nice, right? And the speckles work nicely. Like you want to try some? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I love the viola. Yeah, it's delicious. It's uh, the wine of king, for kings and the king of wine. That's Barolo, right? That's what you say about Barolo. It's a Barolo and yeah. a viola. That's a great, I think it's a great experience. Right. Thank you. Alright, this is uh, Superior Farms land. It's raised out in uh, Fairfield. Fairfield, uh, oh. really close by here. Uh, it's sort of a uh, sweet corn, sweet corn from Pat and uh, charred apron, uh, rapidly shoot, a lot of olives. Mm. Yeah, well, you know, I would take a, I would mix it. I, I, I don't think you're going to be able to get every single uh, component on a bite, but I, mean, I would definitely get some of the fruit with the meat and the corn. Thank you. And the tomatoes. It looks so good. Yeah. Anyway, so the viola, uh, it basically grows like a, it's a very picky grape, and it's not a full body grape. It's, yeah, it's a very, uh, it's almost like a red that has some proper civil white wine. You'll see what I mean when you try it. I cannot wait yeah. to try. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. But it's very interesting, it's, it's more subtle. So it's not full body, right? It's like medium body, but it's very, it has a lot of. Like, a little bit taste of the orange wine. Yeah. 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 Oh, I like it too. Yeah, I think it's one of my favorite grapes. I think it's very interesting and it's very different. When I cut, I can tell. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Perfect. You like it? One of those things that you can't get really good with. It's a meringue, basically. Oh. Interesting dessert. This is looks nice. <laughs> Okay, now we're finished. Do you like it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, so you really enjoy it. I mean, too. Yeah. Mm. yeah, I like uh, most of the dishes. Yeah, I hope I can do more video for that place, but yeah, because they're not allowed. But it's fine, fair. <laughs> All right, thank you guys. See you guys next time.